on today's menu, possibly the most luxurious weeknight recipe. Creamy mushroom pasta. Le ho man, that's how it's going in Cantonese. Welcome to Young Man Cooking, I'm Will Young. Weeknights are for uncomplicated, simple recipes, but simple doesn't have to mean not delicious. Join me in this episode to make a luxuriously creamy mushroom pasta that's perfect for the weeknights. Of course, before we get started, if you enjoyed today's episode, definitely give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below. Let's begin. Generous half cup cashews. Two cups water. Blend on high until liquefied. If you don't have a high power blender, you can soften the cashews by boiling them or soaking them in water overnight. Set aside the cashew cream. To ensure smooth blending, I made about two and a half to three cups of cashew cream, but for today's recipe, you'll only need half. Bring a pot of water to boil for the pasta. About 220 grams of cremini mushrooms. Use a paper towel to brush off the dirt on the mushrooms. Slice the mushrooms. I'm using cremini mushrooms in today's episode, but feel free to use any mushrooms you prefer or have on hand. Definitely looks like a lot, but mushrooms hold so much liquid that it really shrinks down once you go to cook them, so be generous with them. One red onion, diced. This recipe is quite agile, so feel free to use white onions or shallots if you prefer. Three pieces of garlic, finely chopped. Saute pan, medium heat, cremini mushrooms. Give the pan a stir and cook the mushrooms for a few minutes. Allow the mushrooms to cook dry for a few minutes will draw out its initial moisture. Season with a pinch of salt and fresh cracked pepper. Definitely optional, but it wouldn't be young men cooking complete without the use of some smoky, spicy chili oil I made in the previous episode. I'll leave a link in the description box below so you can make this really easily at home. One teaspoon chili oil. Saute the mushrooms for a few minutes. Set the mushrooms aside. Boil half a pound of pasta to one minute less the package instructions, in this case, eight minutes. Feel free to use whatever pasta you prefer and give it a stir occasionally. Saute pan back on medium heat. Two tablespoons chili oil. Red onions. Saute for three to four minutes. Really take time to cook down the onions as it'll grab on that amazing chili oil flavor. Garlic. Saute for another minute. Season with a couple of pinches of salt and fresh cracked pepper. Two tablespoons tomato paste. Saute for a couple of minutes. Third cup white wine. Deglaze the pan and cook for a few minutes. Alternatively, you can use veggie stock or non-alcoholic wine. It's completely up to you. When the pasta's done, save about a quarter cup of pasta water. Strain out the pasta. Add the pasta water to the sauce. Add in half the cashew cream. Give 
give the sauce a good stir. You can try using coconut cream as an alternative to cashew cream, but it may slightly alter the flavor. Add in the pasta. Sauteed mushrooms. Give the pan a good stir. Cook the pasta for another minute or so. Careful not to overcook as the cream can thicken up very quickly. About a third cup of your favorite plant-based cheese. Give the pan a stir and allow the cheese to melt into the sauce. This recipe is good for two portions, but of course you can multiply it to make more. Plate the pasta generously. Sprinkle over some freshly chopped parsley and serve. You can now make this luxurious plate of pasta with absolute confidence. This has got to be the ultimate weeknight comfort food. Wow, that is so, so flavorful. Visually, the dish is just beautiful. It has this rustic, orangey glow and looks just so alluring. That creamy cashew sauce just gets wrapped up in all of those noodles. It has this really luxuriously velvety smooth texture and it's also flavored with that tomato paste which adds this sweet a little acidity and of course that chili oil adds that smoky little spiciness. Those mushrooms are just deliciously earthy and adds a little of that umami and you also get that cheesiness from the plant-based cheese that just melts into this sauce. The white wine adds some body, a little acidity, and a little fruitiness as well. The onions and garlic that we saute just melts into that sauce and gives it such a big punch of amazing flavor. The parsley just adds this beautiful pop of green color and this delicious freshness. Definitely one of those easy, uncomplicated weeknight recipes that's just comforting, super luxurious, like you were served this at an amazing restaurant. Weeknight or not, it's recipes like this that makes it so exciting to cook at home. If you love simple, delicious recipes like that, then definitely check out or pick up your copy of one of the three Young Men Cooking cookbooks. There is a print or digital version of these you can check out in the link in the description box below, along with the Young Men Cooking merch and plant-based sushi masterclass. If you enjoyed today's recipe, definitely give it a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you won't miss a single episode.